Well, the well-known DeSoto Speedway in eastern Manatee County has been sold. YouTube star <laughs> Cletus McFarland is the new owner of that property. ABC 7's Rick Adams joins us live now with more details. Rick. Brother. Live. Jacqueline, good evening. Yes, I am here with that YouTube sensation. It's Cletus McFarland, and Cletus is the uh, new owner of the DeSoto Speedway here in like, Eastern Manatee uh, County. And Cletus, thanks so much for joining us. Oh, hell yeah, brother. Happy to be out here with you. All right. Uh, talk about the Speedway. Why a Speedway, of all things? Well, you know, my cousin Gary Winthorpe told me about this place, and I was looking for the ideal place to do what I do. We make YouTube videos every day with the coolest cars we can build, right? And we needed a playground to test them, to use them, to film our videos where it's legal, safe, and even our fans can come out and join us and have fun, let the freedom flow. So we found a old DeSoto Speedway here, decided to turn it into our own mini burnout stadium that is now known as the Freedom Factory. Okay, what are your long-term plans for the Speedway? You know, long-term, I want to, uh, you know, add some concrete out here, you know, Dang. renovate the place, clean it up, make it look beautiful. You know, this is a historic American racing, you know, legacy right here. We want to we want to see racing coursing through its veins again and, and live action, and we're using a whole new sport to bring it back. And speaking of which, it does uh, need a lot of work. It looks like it needs a lot of work. Uh, yes, any does. any plans for that? Well, we, uh, we have a lot of plans. You know, there's a lot of electrical issues, you know, there's, the grass is overgrown even through the track surface. So, you know, it all started with a lot of burnouts to try and put the weeds down. You know, we got most of them cleared off the track surface, but we need to, we need some more serious equipment to clean this place up. We're going to go for the grass first, go for the electrical next, and start painting from there. Okay, and do you have plans on having it open to the public here where they'll be able to kind of enjoy the racing? Absolutely, sir. Our first event of the year is November 20th through the 21st, Cletus and Cars. It's at the end of the year. It's our grand championship burnout contest. And we plan on having a couple small openings to get our feet wet, you know, bring the people in, see how they like the place. And from there, we'll have our grand championship at the end of the year. and We're going to let it rip. Uh, you seem like a kid in a candy store here. Very excited about this, huh? I'm very excited about the old Freedom Factory. All right, that is Cletus McCorland. Thank you so much. Uh, good luck with the Speedway here, and uh, definitely uh, keep us posted along the way. Thanks, brother. Do it for Dale. All right, uh, Cletus uh, McFarland, the new owner of the DeSoto Speedway. We're going to have a lot more on this coming up tonight at 11 o'clock. Reporting live from Eastern Manatee County, I'm Rick Adams. Jacqueline, back to you. Okay, Rick, thank you. Here we go, round two, boys. The abandoned Woo! DeSoto Speedway in Eastern Manatee County has now been sold Cletus McFarland, well known for his YouTube channel, is now the new owner of that property. ABC 7's Rick Adams had a chance to catch up with him earlier tonight. Jacqueline, good evening. There will once again be a lot of action here at the DeSoto Speedway. A YouTube star is now the proud owner of this property. It's always been a dream for the resident smoke. Cletus McFarland to own a racetrack. That dream is now real for the popular YouTube sensation and car enthusiast. We've been on the everlasting search for a place or a playground for our creations, our cars <laughs> that we build every day for our shows on our YouTube channel. What better than an abandoned speedway that we can fix up and make exactly how we want it. The 63-acre DeSoto Speedway site opened back in the 1970s, but has sat empty for the last two years. The plan is to have a place for Ooh, fans nice of McFarland to come, slide. and he has many. Bald. More than 1.7 million people subscribe to his YouTube channel. They will now shoot a lot of their videos here and eventually host speedway-related events that the public can enjoy. <laughs> we hope to run some very successful events and, you know, boost the economy in the town, bring people in from all over the, the world and, you know, show them how great of an area Bradenton and Sarasota is. McFarland and his team says they will refer to this racetrack as the Freedom Factory. We're hoping to put on a show for the people out here, you know, bring back the legacy of this American historic racing track. The purchase price of the Speedway has not been disclosed. And Cletus and Cars will be the first public event here at the DeSoto Speedway. That's scheduled to take place on November 20th and November 21st. Reporting from Eastern Manatee County, I'm Rick Adams, ABC7, your Suncoast News. Nice. Rick, thank you.